Hey everyone, Sam here. Welcome back to another episode of Sammy Vostok. And just quickly before we get into the whole train network overhaul video, um, don't forget if you ever need to contact me, the best way is probably on my Instagram, uh, which is at Sam Burr. Uh, then under slash so people a lot of people message me on there already but uh, I'm just putting that out there in case you ever want to chat um, I often give advice and you know just have a chat and just see what happens so anyway um, back to this video so today we are starting off where we were in the last video so this is the whole stadium video and if you haven't watched that yet I'll link that above and also why haven't you watched that yet um, so we need to basically do the whole thing now I'm going to pause it because as soon as I put this whole thing in there's like a thousand and one thousand three hundred people or something and my game is so laggy like oh it's so 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 laggy so anyway let's stop winching um, Let's go over to the, over here. So this is the Berlin, um, what's it called? Berlin Hauptbahnhof, which means the Berlin main station. Uh, it's in German, which I speak. This is the main station that I'm going to be using in the downtown transport hub. Now, it's nowhere near done yet, but I'm just showing you guys just for the sake of getting all of this done. So as of now, the main train line, which you probably already know, we have this one that goes along here. So this one was the one that was already in the map. So it goes along here, um, comes down here, and then there's another one that comes along here. And it basically goes along the side of this mountain side. Uh, I think it's, it's a good barrier between all of the, the buildings and then the actual hills. Uh, it goes along here, so it's, you can see it goes along there. We have a station there, station there. Um, and then we get to here and it continues on and goes over and over and over and then basically goes off the map over there. So the it has a good train line already because it, it is it was already two individual train lines. So what I've done off camera is I've made this outer line for the cargo trains now and then the one inside is for passenger trains and just quickly how you do that is you go to the traffic manager and then you go to vehicle restrictions you click on it now you can go in so the bottom two are for cargo and then the top two are for passenger so I've actually noticed the opposite way around so this one is for passenger and this one is for cargo so I've banned passenger trains on the outside and then for here I've banned cargo so that's how you do it and then if you want to do all of them because you see how it's all different separate nodes so you just press down shift as you click and it'll do the whole line for you so that's a handy little trick so that is how you do that and I think it's a lot easier not mixing up cargo trains with passenger trains um, that can lead to a huge huge issue so make sure you have them split up now as of where does this line go so we I'm only going to use two li lines over here so even though it's four um, I've put this building here but that covers the fourth one and then on this side I will do another building that covers this one as well just so it doesn't look like it's being underutilized so I'm going to use these two lines but basically they come around here and they're going to join into one line here I think it's just good to have two lines going in because maybe there's a bit of train traffic and it's good to to split it out but once it gets to here it's going to um, go to one and then you can see that's the one that goes over to the, the stadium area so I, I chose this one because first of all it looks really really cool uh, I use this in Inselstadt I believe or one version of it and it's cool because you can see inside of it um, it's all glass all of it so make sure you're wearing your sunscreen when you go in there um, and then another cool thing is that it's elevated and you can also drag it over the top of the road so I've dragged it half over the top of the road and that's how I'm going to leave it like that and then we have this one that continues on um, goes over the river and then as of from here I don't no, no, I'm not going to leave it like that. It looks a little bit funny, right? The main thing that really annoys me about how this line is, which I placed by the way, is you can see it. It's up quite high. So we have two options. We can either make it into, well, we have three. We can make it all a tunnel, which I'm not going to do because I, I'd rather actually see it. Um, the second one is we can, we can lower it down and then put like a wall barrier. Well, the third one is we can just put a hedge along the side kind of like how I've done up here so I'll think about that for a little while um, but I also want to put a station here because this is going to be quite a large busy area as well so hmm and as of over here I was going to do a train line over to here but I thought it's not really worth it because this is not a big area in general it's not that big and then 
and then we need to put a station over here so that'll be a quick job but then I also want to put a train line that goes over here now I'm kind of like mm, where do I put it so I'm thinking it'll have to break off about here come around um, maybe along the road and then it can maybe go down here follow along the side of this road um, and then we can maybe end it right there uh, because if we put it up further it's just not really it's too wavy like if we continued it on we'd have to go like along the water here then cut off the view of the, the water or we'd have to go up here which is really windy or we could do it along here but then it's really far away for them so um and then if i did it over here then i have to go through the whole fancy golf estate which i don't want to touch like i could put a train this way along here but i just don't want to touch it i could do one that way but yeah i, d I don't want to leave that i just want to leave that how it is so that is the plan um as of everything else i think it's okay i think this track here is okay um i need to adjust these lines here they look a little bit wonky right but ugh. anyway first things first let's go over to here so we have actually am i going to use this one i might I, can't, I don't know if i'm using this one i don't think i need it so let me think uh let me just think for a second so we need one that goes here and then goes up this way so that's one lane and then i can maybe just connect the second one just for intercity ones i guess we only need three and then i can connect the th third one so we can have one going that way um maybe i can connect the middle one going either way and then this one going that way so i think that's okay yeah i think we don't need this this third one here i think it's just a bit too big right so i think what i shall do is i'll go like that and i'll put a building here to disguise that third one so we don't really see it so just ignore that ignore that so let's go up here now to make this work i'm going to utilize this one what's this one called where you press ctrl a to give me more flexibility so let's go like this um now the shape of the double train track there at the top of the screen that was already like that when i got the map i haven't changed that at all now i'm going to connect it but then i need to make it a lot more pointy i guess is the word kind of like that so it just kind of glides straight on now is that okay that is okay good 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 and then this one oops we don't want that one we, we want double like that oh uh, actually is that okay I, th I don't you know what last time i did the train haul overhaul thingy a lot of train enthusiasts came out <laughs> And they're like, oh my god, you can't do this, you can't do that, the gradient is wrong, the elevation is wrong, blah, 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 blah. Now, <laughs> everyone chill, everyone chill, come on. Realistically, there would be a better curve going into this, right? There would be, so let's just, let's just calm down a little, let's calm down. Uh, <laughs> I'm just, just having fun here. Um, we don't need to do it that super realistic because they will still work. Now, I'm doing a double connection... I don't think we'll need to connect to this one anyway because it is cargo so you know what um actually i'll leave the middle one like just just for just in case you know like maybe they just need it one day um, but they have this one which is the main f um, passenger one and then we have this little guy i think i might need to bring i might need to curve him back here more so let's go around um I could go like that. Oh, that doesn't look. Uh, what happens when I update it to two? Is that going to work? That could be good, right? Okay, so let's get the first train connection going. Actually, I'll do it from here first of all. So down there, and it should go. Yeah, see now it's not connecting, and I'm wondering why it's not connecting. Okay, I got it. I just had to click down a little bit more on the station down to there okay um add vehicle what type we don't want the funicular go away funicular we want the this guy here so add we'll do two of them for now excellent so that is this one done that goes up to there um i might make all of this one train network one train line that would make more sense right okay but i can do that later now this one over here we have this second line which we need to connect it somehow can i connect it around this corner or 
is that going to look ugly so let's go to no collision so the pillars don't disappear um, yuck I don't think I can save that that looks really yuck that looks horrible 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 let's connect it here on this straight part that would make more sense right um, so actually does that connect like that does that work it looks a little funny the tracks but I don't know maybe that will work actually will it will that work hmm um let's actually you know what let's drag the train so it's half over the road so then we can still use the the front of the road here to actually con to actually connect buildings because right now um, we can't connect buildings on there so uh, we might have to change the pillar actually yeah I think we might have to so let's go here uh, it's elevated so let's see what type do we want do we want a wide concrete pillar no we don't want that one it has to become quite high this is quite high actually um, double steel that's the normal train one well actually you know what when we let me connect it to this height maybe it'll be okay because it's up quite high let's have a look let's have a look shall we it's pretty high but um yeah when i drag that straight ahead it's right yeah look at it it's right on there mm. okay is there another better one let's have a look have a look have a look maybe a highway pillar is that too big maybe maybe i could I can twist the pillars around like that. Maybe I can do that. Maybe I shall do that. So then they're off the road. We can still add buildings here. There's a road connection, hopefully. Um, I think that is what we shall do. So, that's two lane, two lane. Um, let's choose no collision. Oops, excuse moi. And why are you not connecting? There we go. Oops. And then I'll adjust this in a second. Let's bring it around like that. We want the curve to be nice and big so they can get around really easily. Now let's drag this on and then we'll have to make sure it's not cutting on the intersection around. Actually, we can make it curve like that. Okay, that's good. Um, hmm. It's in the intersection. Let's deal with that first good good what can i do here what can i do maybe if i turn this one if i turn it oh my god there's going to be so much hate about this turn it and then bring it in here like that so there's enough room for them to walk um and then you know what there's still enough space to drive straight ahead good fixed it excellent 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 um so it goes around joins there hopefully that's okay we'll check that in a second and then um i don't know if i'm putting a road here so we can just draw this straight ahead not have any worries in the world and then connect it to this bad boy boy there we go and i know the height's going to be all wacky yeah look at that but that's good um i'll just add a little road connection here so it's actually going to function let's bring it back down to the ground now i'm not going to make the train stations all fancy in this episode that's going to be another episode um i'm just literally putting it down making sure everything works fine they need power nope they got power let's press play so it connects connect come on connect 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 what's going on what's going on with the water come on what's going on there we go good boy good boy <laughs> now we have to deal with this so and now i'm just going to say this straight up before everyone else says it when i do these types of things i don't want them all at the same height okay this is why i don't use this i want it to be a slow decline down so i'm not using this okay okay good let's move on so 
slow decline down slow de decline down slow decline connect how does that look it's a little needs, needs to be a little bit higher on this one i think up 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 and then it goes okay that's fine okay good so the train network is all connected now um let's oops what am i doing this one Whew. let's connect the train line and see if it actually goes all the way if it works fine okay that one come back and then back okay add vehicle remove select the oops oops oops, oops, oops. we want that one so one two maybe two for now i feel like we need three oops press play so that should be fine because it connected up really easily um oh yeah i just need to add in a connection here to that side excellent now this one over here is i'll oh, just quickly i can't actually not allow intercity what is it called allow intercity trains like this one you can click on and off so i've not allowed it but still these ones i am i not seeing it or it's yeah it's not there so it's really annoying so random trains keep coming all the way in and it's really really annoying me please go away <laughs> anyway this station here now i have this one here I, I have this one now i'll just show you guys quickly it's actually uh in the ground a bit so we could use that but one thing i'm wondering is can I add in a wall barrier to that? So I'm going to use my trusty wall. We're going to go no collision. Can I add you in here? Looks like I can. I can. Okay, that's good. That's good. So maybe I can do that. Okay. Yeah, that would be good because then at least we won't see the trains from like, because if you're down here and you look up, you don't really want to see the trains right oh i don't think i want to so i think maybe this is a good idea i think i think and then it can go under the road so that won't disturb them hmm, hmm. i think that's a good idea maybe i'll put the station here because we have a bit more space we have the road right there but let's let's have a play around with it let's go back above the ground delete 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 um i'm just gonna remove everything because i'm gonna have to redo it anyway this one move it into place like so move it into place move it into place so we can make it go under the road there how does this look ugly <laughs> looks ugly at the moment but i think overall i can make it look quite better Let's just leave it at that height. Uh, actually, what's going on with the, the land here? It's a little bit of a weird shape. It goes quite high. What if, can I bring it down like that? Let's make this area flat, just so it's a lot easier to work with. So I want this the same height as that. And then I want this the same height as, excuse me. I want this the same height as this. And then that's fine because it can go up, but we'll demolish that because we need to make a tunnel underneath. Okay, excellent. Can I get in a little tunnel here or is it too close? Is it too close? I feel like it's going to be too close. Actually, it needs to demolish the tunnel first, although it's going to be yuck. Okay, Ugh, minus 10. Come on. Come on then. Straight ahead. Come on, there we go. Okay, so we have an actual tunnel, but is it ugly? Very ugly. <laughs> it's very ugly. Um, hmm. Let's drag it out to about there. Uh, the tunnel, I think we can actually adjust it. If I click on this one and I drag it out to about there, go above the ground. See, it's a bit too high right now. So let's drag it down to about that level right about right there. Okay, that's good. 
and then the road can go over the top of that so that's good there's no interference there it goes underneath here it's a little bit of a weird shape so hang on a second go under select that node come back up bring it down like so keep going good good um now this part here i didn't make a tunnel because if I did, it would have to come out quite close to the, the water, which I don't want. Um, and if it was a, a bridge, then it's going to be a bit weird because it goes from a tunnel then to a bridge here and then has to come back down to this elevation here. So I think just the road crossing is the best choice for this position. And uh, if there's a lot of traffic, we'll just deal with it. I think we, we'll be fine. We can work something out in the, in the end. Okay, so I've added in the wall barriers. So we have this one here, which is on the curved part. It looks a little bit wobbly, but you know what? It'll do. We have it in the train station, and then it goes all the way up to here, all the way up to the corner where it basically comes back to ground level. But in the end, it's going to look quite good because we don't actually see it going around. So it's just going to look so much more compact. And it looks, it does look very, it's like, oh, it's kind of ugly, right? But you know what? It's a train. It's not really for sightseeing it's for getting around so it's done so this is going to be the end of the line here because i can't i can't get a train through here there, there's no way i could get one through there and i'm not doing a tunnel through the whole thing um yeah just don't want to do a train through there i think i think a train through here would wreck it so they can get off here transfer onto the monorail and go basically wherever they need to go now as for over here looks good so this one's coming around um this one is functioning oh Two train lines. Oh, I thought that was how many people. Come around, let's pause, it's getting laggy. And then comes around, that's good, good, good. And then how about over here? How does this look? So the intercity train is the middle one. Um, now we'll use this lane here as well, I guess it still has to go over here, but it'll come around over to here and connect up to this station. So let's do a little station now. What do we have? What can we use? It doesn't have to be fancy. Just, I just really need, need to just put down a, a thingy. We could do that one. Actually, we'll do this one because um, one of the lanes will be for the, um, the cargo. Actually, I might leave both of them there, but we will make an, a third lane. So we'll just put that there. And then we'll just drag him up here to the more straighter part, like so. Just like, just like that. We'll put it right up against it to make it more compact. So how close is that? That's a bit too close, actually. Oh, there's the little walkways as well, so maybe I shouldn't put it right up too close. But yeah, we'll go like that. Um, and then let's get the train line and connect him around there like that there we go easy peasy can we make that look a bit nicer or or nah i don't know if that'll work good but hmm i wonder if that'll work it's very pointy but i like it like that I just realized we don't actually need a connection going that way, but you know what? We're doing it. We're just going to do it anyway. Okay, we'll give him a little connection so he actually functions for now. He can just go like that. I guess he needs water. Yes, he does. Excuse me, he needs water. Thank you. And then um, power as well. So there we go. That's good. So this is going to uh, serve this whole area. And I quite like this station because... It's got the nice walkway over the top. I like that. Okay, so we don't need one down there, really. I mean, we can do maybe like a shuttle bus that goes down to there or something in, in the future. So let's have a look. So this part is done. This part's done. 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 We have a connection going over down to here. Now, we have a station here. I was thinking, like, oh, should I put one there? But they're really close. Mm. It's really, really close. But this is a big office area but that is no nah, oh no nah, let's not put one here let's not put one there because it's the station is literally right there they don't need it it's 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 okay they don't need it um so this part is all done i think now the last one that we need to do is we need to get 
something going on over here and then getting the train line up through here. Hmm. So maybe I'll make the train station here? Because I don't, I don't want to put it in the middle. So let's find one. I think I downloaded an older fashioned train. Oh, is it this one? Yeah, it's, it's just a little train. Oh, it's in their backyard. Just a little one. Look at that. <laughs> just a little train. Um, yeah, we need to reduce their back fence. Okay. I think that'll be okay. So yeah, just one train line going out to here. Just a little station. Um, yeah, so let's... I'll just try and get a train line through. I don't even know if it'll look good. So choose that one. And let's just have a bigger look where I'm going. So I'll make it generally follow around along the road. And then... Yeah, we'll make it branch off up there because I don't want it to like just split down the middle because I think that'll look a little bit ugly we'll have to mm, should I put it here they're noisy right they're quite noisy yeah so we'll put it up there somewhere but I will have to demolish we'll demolish one of these houses right there there we go now the station where is the station going to go first of all Let's just add in a little road connection. Um, we can use this existing one already. Like so, good, good, good. Now, what do we have? Do we have anything else that I could use that's a little bit more, a bit more interesting? But I don't think I do. I could put in this one. It's a little bit big. Now we'll do the single one again. Actually. The ground doesn't look flat. No, it's not. I need to flatten it out first. Plunk you in there. Good. Hmm, but this is a main road here. No, it'll be fine. They can get over it. And then, I don't know what I'm going to do here. There may be a... Um, like a suburb here. And if so, we can very easily just add in a connection there but as for now I don't think so I don't think so now since the trains can only go on the passenger trains can only go on this side I need to break it away so I need it to connect across did that connect across that is disgusting <laughs> what of course it deletes the whole track yes that's what I said to do right mm-hmm I can just go like that. That's good. Make it a bit straighter, like so. Might do the same here as well. So it's a little bit messy. Maybe we can try to just do a connection like that. Jesus, I'd hate to be the controller of that. What a mess. What a mess. So I can go along here. Follow along the side of the the trees come up here near the road go around okay actually let's do it from this side first it's gonna be a mess might have to do a video about this one connection right there that's gonna be a mess um come on bridge oh, that's why you just need a little bridge across back to the ground oh, come on I shouldn't have to tell you there we go there we go and then this guy can come up around there like that um, when I do whatever I do in this area this will probably be managed a bit more nicely but for now we're just gonna leave it like that so we have this connection here like that so maybe I can add in another connection create new line can it go over to there oops hang on a second we got to connect it good 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 so create a new line so this one can go over to there like that and then down to the mini one and then back and then back add vehicle which is no we don't want the funicular train add so let's just do two of those excellent 
and then we can do another one that goes actually we already have the one that goes around there so i guess these guys if they have to go down to this one transfer and then go back that way which might be a little bit annoying maybe in the future when i add one there but yeah i think that's all i think that's all right so these guys now have connection right this town has a connection this future suburb has a connection um this is the main one so that's all connected this guy is new and connected actually let's have a look what's how, how's this going looks like he's not bothered by that so that's okay um this guy is all done good and connected good 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 and they can zoom along here come down to the end here then transfer if they need um these lanes are all connected up oh, hang on a second we forgot we forgot we forgot got 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 to add uh, now it's gonna look ugly isn't it yep it is whatever whatever um maybe i should do just one more hopefully it doesn't overload it one that goes express so it bypasses the city actually yeah this is mm, no this one would just be express it goes up here and then you can stop at this one and go into this one it's town mm, i don't know if i actually need that actually yeah you know what forget that one forget that one maybe in the future we'll need it but i think for now that is okay i think everything's okay i think it's fine so i think let's just do the coloring and then and then i'll wrap up the video so we have oh hang on which is this one which is this one oh that one's been the one i just i just did yeah delete you good so we have this one which is this is really messy is this the funicular one come on show me this is the funicular one so let's just type that in can't spell funicular funicular excellent give you a bit of colors let's make you red why did it just move you are why is it not showing oh, i guess i have to go like that so this one is what oh my god there's just so much stuff on the screen i feel overwhelmed what is this area called this is samo sibersk let's just call it that samo sibersk is that how i spelled yeah good enough this one next where is this one going again does this one goes all the way right let's just say is it that one yeah sports line sports center line there we go done next one ah that's the extra funicular one so it was this one so we'll make him also green funicular two good next this one is actually this area doesn't have a a name does it let's just call it for now warehouse warehouse district because the warehouse is there oh wait where does it go or is it going over here ah oh, this one is the country line country town line next next one is ugh. oh better give it a color make it that color good this one is this what's this area called again is it novo bursk or something come on borovsky which is again which one was it this one right 
Oh, this is overwhelming. It's overwhelming. No, this is the warehouse to... Okay, let's just call it warehouse precinct for now. Give you a color. We go. This one. Uh, this one is going... F this is the downtown to this one. Let's just call it downtown. I'm just going to make it a lot easier. And then this one is... Hello. Uh, this one this one goes along the side of the mountain so let's just call it the mountain side oh, mountain side line there we go is that all okay that's all nine okay well that's it you guys that is hopefully going to make everything a lot better so just to wrap up new station here new station here new station here this is a new station to you guys new 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 in last episode and then the rest is old news so that's all um if you have any suggestions for train lines tips tricks whatever um where it should go uh definitely definitely let me know and i shall have a look and who knows maybe it'll be in the next episode so thank you guys for watching and i'll see you all very soon bye guys